Hello, so I'm going to show you how to upload our CP software using our iFlash handsets. Uh, it's fairly easy to do. Uh, it doesn't matter which model of car you have, they usually the same. Um, so you want to open up your iFlash installer, which comes on the USB, or if it's out of date, then you can download it off of our website on the support page. So make sure the ignition is turned on. But don't turn the car on, just have the ignition on. So then it will run through all the checks. Uh, next, click next. And it tells you to do not interrupt the communication. Don't interrupt the communication, otherwise your car won't turn on and you'll need a recovery file. So, because this is a Focus SE diesel, it doesn't come up with ECU. So you'll have to put it in yourself, which is a... DCM 6.1, yes, usually they come up with the correct ECU and you don't have to do that. So you want next. So you want to read your ECU memory uh, and it just put it on the desktop or somewhere easy for you to find. So this is now reading your standard file. Uh, which we will need uh, and so when this is done uh, I will, will come back to you okay okay so you want to send one of those files that it uh, read off the car uh, send it in an email to us and then we can send you back the correct mod file for your car so uploading is the reverse of reading so you want a specific mod file that we send you. So it says, turn ignition off, wait five seconds, turn ignition back on, uh, and keep the driver's door open because you don't want it to go off, the ignition to go off during this time. So, one, five, turn it back on again. Okay. Car will go a bit crazy. Don't worry, it's meant to make that noise. <laughs> Can be a bit disconcerting, but it's fine. So then it's calculating. Now you do not want the ignition to turn off whilst it's doing this, otherwise your car won't turn on again. I've had it a few times where it's accidentally turned off for one reason or another and then we have to send you a recovery file. Right, so it'll upload. So it's now uploading the modified file. So when that's done I will come back to you. Okay, so it's coming up to finishing. There we go. There we go, and the car will make some funny noises. Don't worry about it. So switch the ignition to off. Ignition is off. There we go. That's it. It's now we program the ECU with the update file in the mod and there we go and it should be fine so there you go easy as that